Hi friends, in this session, I am going to explain about Snowflake schema in Power BI. This is one of important schema in Power BI reporting. Most of the clients prefer Snowflake schema to develop their reports. If you are watching first time my video, please subscribe and like my channel and also share with your friends. Why? Because in this channel, I am providing complete training of Power BI from beginning level to advanced level and also interview questions, real-time project explanation with scenario based monthly updates much more updated in this channel. If you follow my classes from class 1, you will definitely will get the job and also easy to survive in real-time environment. So in this video, we will deep dive about Snowflake schema in Power BI. In this video, I am going to cover what is Snowflake schema in Power BI what is the difference between star schema and snowflake schema? What are the benefits of fact table and dimension table in Power BI? Let me explain one by one. Let me go to my browser. Snowflake schema. Example. Let's go to images. By seeing images, we can easily understood. Let me make this big. Come here. Snowflake schema is nothing but it contains a fact table, one or more fact table and surrounding dimension tables and this dimension table again containing sub dimension table. This is nothing but snowflaking. Okay. If any dimension table contain at least one uh, sub dimension table it is called as snowflake schema so if you observe star schema star, st star schema can contain one or more fact tables and surrounding dimension tables okay so fact table as i said in fact table contain foreign key relationship with the dimension tables and dimension tables containing primary key relationship with the fact tables. Now let me go to official document star schema and snowflake schema in Power BI. This is the official document. Microsoft Power BI team. Let me go to this page. Come down. See here. This is the star schema. Fact reseller sales and the surrounding dimension tables having. It does not. It, this dimension tables doesn't contain any sub dimension table. That is the difference. If any dimension table contain at least one sub dimension table then it is called as snowflake schema come down don't worry i will explain very very simple technique see here this is snowflaking that means here fact reseller sales table is under dim, dim product is this product table again it is having dim product subcategory is there this subcategory again containing dim product category is nothing but snow flaking okay don't worry i will show practically also for example if you have one fact table and you have one dimension table then it is called star schema okay it uh, this dimension table doesn't contain any sub dimension now that is the difference of uh, star schema and uh, snowflake schema and benefits what are the benefits of fact table and dimension table in Power BI? Very, very important. Please don't skip my video. These are all our interview questions. And very important to understand to implement the project. Dimension to tables are support filtering and grouping. Okay. By using dimension tables, we can group and we can filter the data. Okay, fact 
course summarization summarization is nothing but uh, we can group uh, we can group the tables and we can uh, summarize like we can find the total sales average sales we can summarize i will ex don't worry i will explain in coming videos you just follow my videos that's it now i will show you practically how it will be dimension table and fact tables and uh, star schema and snowflake scheme now let me connect to my sql server if anybody watching first time audio i am strongly recommended please check class number 3 and 4 why because in class number 3 and 4 i clearly explain how to download and install adventure works database 2017 and north wing database because these databases are look like real in real world also we are using okay, here some less data is there there more data is there that only difference nothing is different okay so that's the reason i am telling you come here now see here here dimension table is there dimension tables are there correct dim date is there if you come here dim product dim product category dim product subcategory that means this table so this dimension table having one more sub dimension correct this product uh, dim product category again it is dim product subcategory this is nothing but snow flagging okay i will show you how it will be there so this is by seeing the data you have to recognize fact tables you can have more fact internet sales fact reseller sales fact product inventory whatever fhct these are our fact tables these are our tables now i will show you star schema how it look like if the data contain see here i will take one dim date table and dim product i'm not taking dim product category and subcategory if i'm taking that will be star schema like that so now i'm taking at least one fact table without fact table we cannot perform any calculations in real world okay just let me click on load while loading tables automatically it will detect the relationships and the automatically it will map don't worry it won't take much time please observe what happening while loading the tables see how many rows detecting relationships working on it my tables are loaded now now let me go to model view now see i loaded three tables fact table and dim product and dim date so this dimension table doesn't contain any sub dimension so this is called as we can this is we can say as star screen okay now i am loading let me load more tables to explain snowflake schema adventure works now i will take dim product category dim product subcategory let me click on load okay tables are loading don't worry it won't take much time now my tables are loaded let me go to model view now check the relationship now see here this dim product again having relationship with the here see here here it is snow tracking correct here fact table is there centralized and dim date is there and dim product is there and this dim product again linked to dim product subcategory and dim product category so snowflake schema will be like this by seeing data only we need to recognize so thank you for watching my video if you like my video please comment and please share
actual training please email to this email and you can directly contact to this number and my whatsapp number also same number thank you for watching my video keep watching my videos